Hey, what is up you amigos? My name is Super Everyone, welcome back to another Watch Dogs video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the all new exclusive features for multiplayer on Watch Dogs for the next gen consoles. And we're also going to be talking about the current features that will still be available for the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360. But it doesn't stop there because we also have some new information about the weather in the game as well. So it is going to be a pretty awesome video. As always, if you're going to enjoy it, make sure you guys do punch that like button. Let's try to get something over 100 plus likes, guys. That'll be really appreciated. And especially since we are only 23 days left away for this game, how hyped are you? Let me know down in the comments below. And without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So it does seem that the creative director Jonathan Moran is doing a pretty good job of getting us all hyped for this game because he is still replying back to questions over on Twitter and first of all he explained that the seamless online invasion and tailing will be available on every platform releasing soon, which he clarified to be the PS4, PS3, Xbox One and the 360. He also mentioned that the next generation consoles will have two exclusive features and this does include the PC as well. And these exclusive features are data decryption and the bonus free roam online options. Now this did actually get me thinking what these options could possibly be and we are going to be discussing this in the podcast which hopefully should be up tomorrow or Tuesday. But either way I want you to tell me right now down in the comments below what you think these options could be. Now considering more in said platforms releasing soon this might not include Wii U but someone did ask him over on Twitter and they didn't get a response as of yet but he did send a request for clarification to Ubisoft. So it isn't 100% confirmed, I guess you could say it's just word in the air, but as soon as we do get an update for that, I'll let you know down in the comments below. Now, a lot of people have been asking whether or not we can manually set the weather in the game, and the answer to this is no, so as you could imagine, now the question is, why can't we do this? And Jonathan explained that Watch Dogs has always been about dynamism. So it did not seem a priority to add features that didn't support that idea, and ultimately the team had to stop somewhere. So in all honesty, I do prefer a game with dynamic weather because it's just all random. For instance, one minute you could be driving in your car and the sun's out, it's all nice and sunny, and then in the blink of an eye, it could start pouring down with rain, there could be thunderstorms, etc, etc. So it just kind of forces you to adapt, and like I said, if it was sunny, and then it just starts to rain whilst you are driving, it would definitely add to the challenge inside of this game, because when it's raining, of course, the roads are going to be more slipperier, therefore it will be kind of hard to drive. So in my point of view, I do like this, but do you? Let me know down below. And if you didn't know, the Xbox 360 version will contain two discs like GTA 5, one which you will have to install, and then the other one you will use to play on. And Jonathan has confirmed that the installation size will be 7.5GB and if you don't have a hard disk or don't have enough space, you'll need an 8GB or more USB key with a data transfer speed superior to 15MB. But either way, that does bring today's video to an end. I hope you guys did enjoy this one and if you did miss yesterday's video, there will be a link for you in the description below. And if you guys are new to this channel, thank you for stopping by. Please do hit that subscribe button below to stay up to date with the latest in Watch Dogs news, ideas, updates and all that good stuff that will be really appreciated. And of course, you will become an amigo and part of the amazing, awesome, beautiful team. So in 23 days, I will see you over in Chicago and I'm also going to see you tomorrow because... There's going to be a video tomorrow, so yeah, until then guys, I hope you have an awesome day, and adios amigos.